guitar songs are, uh, uh, I mean, I'll play you a guitar song. It's a little different. Uh, if we go to, uh, let's say, Tina Turner, which, you know, one of my favorite artists in the world, you know. Um, um, uh, um, this song, I, I'd just come in from Los Angeles, uh, and I was so jet-lagged, and I couldn't sleep, and it was like 5 in the morning, and I knew they were picking me up at 8, and um, I... I suddenly finally fell asleep, you know, and when my publisher knocked on the door, you know, I, I said, look, I, I can't go. I mean, I was supposed to meet Graham Lyle for the first time down at his house in, I don't know, down south somewhere. Um, anyways, uh, um, I said, I can't go, I can't, and he said, look, we've set this up from a long, long time ago, you have to do it. So I said, okay, fine. I had a shower, he drove me down, um, I, you know, I had some coffee with Graham, went up to his little studio at his house. He gave me this beautiful blonde J200 to play and said, I'll be right back, I'm just gonna get another guitar. And while he was gone, I started to go, I don't wanna lose you, for no reason. I don't even wanna say goodbye. And he walks in, he says, what's that? And I go, I don't know. Put it down on tape, he goes. So I put it on tape, and then he says, he says, you know, I, I had this little verse before you came, you know. And he goes, da da di da da di da da di da da And I thought, oh, good. Well, all we have to do now is put that little verse at, to, to my little chorus, and we have to find a way to do that, you know. So this is how it ended up being, you know. It went, women of a certain age, they learn. Responses haven't played the mating game. She doesn't waste time because all that she wants is real and honest emotions. Ones that he never shows, and though I hardly call your name, I know. And so there, there's a two different songs. I mean, this one I could not have written on piano, mm -hmm. and the other one I couldn't have written on guitar. And that you know. song was written in what sounds like about 10 minutes. Yes, because my publisher said, you know, listen, call me at the end of the day when you're done. So before he had arrived at, back at, in London, I called him on his mobile, said, could you come back and pick me up? I really need to go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> so you just had to knock out a million-selling hit before bedtime, basically. Yes, yes. Albert Hammond, thank you so much. It's been a pleasure. No, it's been my pleasure. It's been great. Thanks.